Hello and welcome to Stabilize. Today we're going to be looking at the Garrison Stable Achievement Mounts. The Garrison Stable Achievement Mounts are available through killing the quest mobs for the Garrison Stable Achievement Training, which you will kill around Nagrand, with certain items in your inventory. The Garntooth Necklace is the one you need for the Frostwolf Howler, and the Black Claw of Sethe is the one you need for the Frost Plains Battle Ball. In order to get these mounts, you have to defeat each of these mobs with each of the mounts being mounted at the time. This means that it's a little tricky to go around and do everything all at once. However, you are able to do mounts in training quests once you have fully trained one specific type of mount. After training all six types of mounts, you are able to do mount in training quests for all of the types of mount. After having all of these whistles that you get to summon them out in your inventory, you can go around Nagrand mounting up and defeating the enemy. Please remember that the Black Claw of Sethe and the Garntooth Necklace cannot be done at the same time, which means you have to do it at least, you have to go around at least once with the Garntooth and then at least once with the Black Claw. However, doing all of this with all of the mounts will result in you getting these two mounts. However, these mounts aren't actually that especially awesome. In fact, they're kind of lackluster. In all honesty, they're alright, they're pretty good looking. They are Draenor mounts after all, so they are one of the newest graphical looking mounts, so they're pretty sweet in that sense, but generally they're nothing really special. They're nothing actually that unique for going to all that effort. And it's true that it's not really much effort, however it's still effort, and I think it's kind of wasted effort, honestly. They're not they're very unique, they don't look particularly amazing, they're just sort of standard mounts. Naturally, if you're a mount aficionado like I am, then you'll be getting these mounts anyway. However, I would highly recommend, if you're not, really don't bother. The extra effort probably isn't worth it for two fairly bog-standard mounts, after all. 